Jackie and John. All right, thanks, Amelia. Well, Friday, Timmy was talking about flowers. Today, all about your sweetie's sweet tooth. Our eyes, our nose, and now our teeth. Tim is at Chocolate, 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 where they are yes. rolling out some wonderful Valentine's favorites. Tim, what's your favorite so far? Those chocolate-covered strawberries? Well, yeah, I mean, you gotta look over here. Take a look on the table over here. We got some <laughs> naked berries. Now, Dan Abel's joining me, Mr. Chocolate. Now, you know the difference between naked and naked, right? No, tell me. Naked means you don't have any clothes on. Naked means you don't have any clothes on and you're up to something. I like it. Naked. I'm going to use it. Yeah, I'm going to use it. These berries are up to something. Yes, they are. Because they're about to be up to their necks in chocolate. All the way. All the way. Ten, how many berries Double are you going to go through? You know, it's a good question. Um, we always like to add up at the end because the number, because, you know, when you get in in the morning, then you have to, like, cut all the berries and dip them in chocolate and pack them. The numbers kind of freak you out a little bit. Sure. But it's a six-figure number. It's over 100,000. We just don't know how much over. How much yeah. over. It's a work in progress. Yeah. But as you mentioned, they're not just going to get dipped. They're going to be double dipped. Double dipped twice. Tell me the secret there. What's, what's the secret behind double dipping? So my dad, uh, 42 years ago, started, um, he would cut the tips off the strawberries. Instead of half dipping them, we cut the tips off the strawberries, run them sideways, and then run them a second time in chocolate to get a better chocolate to strawberry ratio. And then, you know, the rest is history. So we're doing the same way. Same chocolate, same, different, different berry, obviously, but... Uh, but it's the same, you know, it's the same exact box of chocolate strawberries you got in 1981 as you do right now. That consistency, that tradition, what does it mean to you to be such a vital part of how so many people in St. Louis celebrate Valentine's Day? So we would we would see it at our original store because we would, you know, back 10, 15 years ago, we had much smaller staff, much less equipment. So people would wait in line for 20, 30 minutes as they're coming right off the line. Now we have more manpower, more horsepower to do it. We still have so many people coming to the store in the morning you know on the 12th and the 13th and the 14th and so you know i feel like if i'm going to give that gift to somebody the person receiving that knows that they had to go out of their way to get that box of chocolate covered strawberries like you had to you know if you go today you had to leave work today go to one of our stores pick it up keep it refrigerated somehow hide it and then give it a box. it just adds more special to it it is special it is the chocolate covered strawberries right here chocolate 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 it's a family show. We're going to get these naked berries dressed for you coming up right here. Naked. Five <laughs> in the morning. Naked.